Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Nirmal here and in this video, we're going to talk about some of the best smartphones you can buy in this uh, 15 to 20k price segment in India. So we recently did a video on uh, the smartphones to buy below the 15k price segment uh, and in that video we uh, covered our best six smartphones. So this segment is uh, the 15 to 20k price segment uh, we are going to cover in this video. So let's get started with uh, the best smartphones to buy below the 20k price segment. So first up in the list is the POCO F1. So uh, strictly speaking, the POCO F1 is not a below the 20k price segment, but it is priced at 20 to plan. But we have included this device because of um, the highly powerful hardware you get for uh, 21,000 in India. So the POCO F1 comes uh, with a, a 6.18 inches uh, full HD plus resolution display. This has uh, multiple variants. The base variant has 6 gigabyte RAM and 64 gigabyte storage. It has um, uh, the MIUI uh, version. This MIUI for POCO, it's not the regular MIUI, but it has a refined version of the MIUI and this is powered by one of the best smart uh, processors available right now the Snapdragon 845 Octa-Core chipset so if you are a person uh, into gaming this is definitely a great smartphone it has also liquid cooling technology and uh, the cameras are kind of uh, quite okay it has a 12 megapixel primary camera 5 megapixel secondary camera and a 20 megapixel uh, uh, selfie camera as well and this comes with a polycarbonate body and this has 4000 mAh capacity battery so that's the POCO F1, a really powerful hardware and uh, uh, if you're looking for the best performing uh, device, the POCO F1 probably is the better choice out there. You have to spend additional 1K over the 20K price segment, but it's definitely worth that price you pay for the device. So that's the POCO F1. So next in the list is the Honor Play. So right now we don't have the Honor Play with us, but the Honor Play comes with a really great hardware. And this is one of the really powerful smartphones. It is powered by the Kirin 970 Octaco chipset. And this has a, a, a 6.3 inches full HD plus resolution display. The notch is included. Then we have the EMUI 8.2 and it has Android 8.1 Oreo. Then we have a, a 4 gigabyte RAM and 64 gigabyte storage being offered at 19990. And there is also an upgraded within the which has 6 gigabyte ram so again a really great device for gaming because it's a flagship processor the 970 is uh, uh, the flagship processor and uh, this also comes uh, with a good battery life 3750 mAh capacity battery now the cameras are kind of okay they're not the best out there but still uh, you can get a decent performance it has 16 megapixel uh, re camera secondary 2 megapixel camera and it also has a uh, 16 megapixel selfie camera as well so that's the honor play price at 99 so next up in the list is vivo's latest smartphone the vivo v9 pro so the phone comes with 6.3 inches uh, full hd plus resolution display it also has the notch and uh, this also has the snapdragon 660 octa core chipset it has 6 gigabyte ram and 64 gigabyte storage being offered and it also has a 13 and 2 megapixel camera combination and the front camera is uh, again at uh, 16 megapixel shooter and uh, this also has a uh, pretty good uh, battery life as well 3260 mAh capacity battery and this is, has uh, the fun touch OS on top of Android 8.1 Oreo. So this is a good package all around this is made of plastic material and uh, this has um, pretty good cameras as well. So that's the Vivo V9 Pro which is priced 17990 in India. So it's a powerful device uh, pretty good for gaming and uh, uh, it has a really nice design as well. So next up in the list is Xiaomi's Mi A2. So Mi A2 is an Android 1 powered smartphone. This has uh, the Snapdragon 660 Octa-Core chipset and a uh, really great uh, performing device uh, in this price segment. This has stock Android and uh, Android uh, updates are pretty much promised for this device. And this has uh, 5.99 inches uh, full HD plus resolution display. This is probably one of those devices which does not have a notch in this price segment. And uh, it has a really great uh, set of cameras probably one of the best smartphones uh, with a great camera it has a 12 megapixel primary camera secondary 20 megapixel shooter and also selfie camera is a 20 megapixel shooter with a uh, great uh, overall camera abilities the phone has uh, a usb type c port and 3000 mAh capacity battery probably the downsides include the 3.5 mm audio jack available on this device and there is also no micro sd card expansion slot so that's a mi a2 price just 16.999 so that's uh, the uh, Mi A2. Now next up in the list is the Moto One Power. 
So Moto One Power is a really good smartphone with uh, excellent battery life, 5000 mAh capacity battery, and uh, really great battery life. This is again under Android One platform. It has a, a 6. Point, uh, uh, two inches uh, full HD plus resolution display and this is powered by the Snapdragon uh, 636 octa-core chipset and uh, it has Android 8.1 audio along with the stock Android and uh, this is under the Android one platform so you might be getting the updates on a regular basis now on the camera front uh, this has um, a 16 megapixel shooter a 5 megapixel secondary camera and a 12 megapixel selfie camera included and the best part of this device uh, is the 5000 mAh capacity battery uh, that gives you almost two uh, days plus battery life so if you are looking for great battery life the moto one power is probably the best uh, device in this price segment now next step in the list is the nokia 6.1 plus so if you're looking for a compact smartphone with great looks then the nokia 6.1 plus is probably the good option available in this price segment because it has 5.8 inches um, full hd plus resolution display it has a notch and uh, this is glass finishing really great finish all around and the cameras are also kind of okay this has 16 megapixel primary camera 5 megapixel secondary camera and it also has a 16 megapixel selfie camera as well now this has 3000 mAh capacity battery and it also has uh, stock android and it has already got the android pi update uh, that's the beta version but still it will be getting the pi update pretty soon so that's something really good or from Nokia or for this device so if you are looking for the latest version of Android and stock Android experience along with a compact form factor the Nokia 6.1 plus is a great device uh, the only probably the only downside is that the smaller capacity battery and the low-light performance of the camera is kind of average so these were the best uh, six smartphones to buy in the 15 to 20k price segment other devices also are there in this price segment uh, especially the upgraded or rather the top end variants of the honor 8x is available at 16 triple nine and also 18 triple nine and you also get uh, the realme 2 pro which is available at 15990 and uh, 17990 you also get 8 gigabyte ram with realme 2 pro so these are the upgraded variants of uh, or rather the uh, uh, higher variants of the realme 2 pro and on our 8x and apart from that there is also other devices like the huawei's nova 3a which is priced 2990 which is a really great smartphone if you look particular about looks it also has a kirin 710 which is a relatively new chipset so these are some of the best options to buy in the 15 to 20k price segment in india so which is your favorite among these smartphones? Do drop in your thoughts in the comment section. So hope you enjoyed watching this video. This is Normal signing off. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.